Welcome back <laughs> to Vlogmas Day 5. We're here. We're back with another video. And today is Vlogmas Day 5 and your girl made it, okay? Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, welcome. I am Jose. I'm 26 years old and we are participating in Vlogmas 2021. If you are not subscribed, please make sure you guys hit that subscribe button so you can be a part of this family. And turn on your post notification bell so that you guys are notified every time that I upload. As you guys know, with Vlogmas, you are uploading every day until the end of the month. So I'm going to be uploading every day. So you guys are going to see a lot of me, but it's good because we're going to be able to hang out every day together and do things together. So I'm excited. But today it is about 1045 and I'm currently Semi dressed, not really dressed. I just took my flexi rods out and I put my little um, reindeer headband on that I got from Five Below, if you are curious. And I'm wearing this really cute shirt that I got from Cider, which I'll link in the description below. So I'm wearing that and then I'm also wearing my H&M knit pants. I will link those as well. And I'm getting ready to make my cup of coffee. We'll go ahead and make a regular cup of coffee on my espresso machine. So. But before we get started, I will typically take my vitamins when I come down with the water to hydrate myself before I drink a cup of coffee. So these are my vitamins. I'll link this down below too. This is like a really cute vitamin pack. This is a really cute vitamin pack that I got from Amazon and it has all the days of the week. And then I also have my Goalie Superfruits gummies right here. I've been taking these for some weeks now. Um, I have like a two other bottles that I take, but these are the ones that I take in the morning, so I will be taking that as well. The vitamins that I take, they are, first of all, allergy medicine. That's like number one, my allergy medicine. My biotin pills, my vitamin C, my alpha max, and um, zinc. So these are like the pills that I take um, every morning, and some days I will forget, just, being real with y'all some days i will forget and i won't take no vitamins <laughs> those are the vitamins that i take and i did get some of those vitamins off of amazon so i will link those as well if you guys are interested we are going to be making my cup of coffee on my espresso machine so i use the breville express espresso machine and it's just a beauty i love it it's so easy to use and it's just fun to make, be able to make my own latte at home. The recipe that I'm gonna be making this morning is my pumpkin vanilla latte and it smells delicious. So let's get straight into how I make my coffee. be using today is going to be first things first this pumpkin butter from Trader Joe's this stuff is amazing and this is how you're gonna get that pumpkin flavor um, in your coffee next thing is cinnamon you don't have to add this if you don't want this in your coffee but this does add a great touch to it as well and then the next flavoring is going to be um, vanilla extract so you just can use this um, unless you have made like a vanilla syrup, then that would be even better. This is what I use to get that vanilla flavoring. And then you guys can use any kind of milk you wanna use. Obviously, if you are lactose, then you wanna go ahead and get something that's non-dairy. But I'm gonna be using silk coconut milk. This is my favorite, favorite, favorite coconut milk. Whatever you wanna use, you can use whatever milk you want. And for today's um, coffee beans, we are gonna be using um, this Mayan Blend, this is a whole, uh, whole bean coffee. And I'm using this because this is what I had got from Costco, because I wanted to try it out. It's supposed to be like organic coffee and everything. So this is what we're gonna be using today for the beans. Machine. It's 
guys can see, but I'm gonna do like about this much. I feel like that's enough. I'm gonna go ahead and add in our vanilla. All right, you guys, so now that our coffee is complete and done, let's do a little taste test. You know down in the comments how you make your coffee in the morning, if you just stick to something simple, um, if you use an espresso machine, if you use a Nespresso machine, whatever you do, let me know in the comments, like what's your favorite go-to drink to make at home. And let's, let's just try this baby. Ooh. This is so good. <laughs> Cheers! Now we can officially get the day started. So let's get this day started. <laughs> Now it's time for Christmas And Christmas is my favorite time of year It's beginning to look like all my wishes Are coming true, that's why I cheer I've been busy decking the halls I've been kind to big and small And now it's time to have a merry holiday What a feeling when it's time for Christmas Let's sing a carol and we'll bring it here I guess that spring and summer they're all fine but I've been waiting for the season that's mine So let it come Yeah, let it come Snowflakes fall, I can hear the sleigh bells call They're saying it's time to have a merry holiday What a feeling, now it's time for Christmas Alright you guys, so we're here at the ramen place now And yeah, well with this, I'm gonna sing it with this um, we are at the ramen place and I ended up ordering the miso ramen with with garlic with the black garlic broth so that was actually pretty good um, mine is really good oh and then I didn't get any egg so and then Kyle what did you get miso ramen with the fried chicken yeah the fried chicken is different I was a little like, mm, but I tried it, it's not bad. It's just, I feel like it could have been like a little bit more crispier. But I mean, this is their way of making their fried chicken, so I can't really compare it to fried chicken, but I feel like if it was crispier, it would be like really on point. But all in all, like it was still good. I don't, I wouldn't say like it was bad. I'll give it like a, 
a 7 out of 10. Yeah, I'll give it a 7 out of 10, but this is smacking right now, y'all. This is so good. <laughs> So went to crumble cookie for the first time ever ever ah, in the Christmas spirit we were listening to Christmas music on the way here well slightly but Kyle was saying he's trying to see which one is which so we're gonna guess all right so go ahead which one do you think which one's yours, this one's yours. let me see probably cuz you have chocolate chips in yours so do you I think mine's is this one. Mm -hmm. You said this one's yours. This no, one's this one's yours. Oh, and then I said the opposite. So, ready? I knew it. Dang, oh, yours look good. <laughs> this one, mine. I was right. You have to look fluffy. I know. Look at you guys. Dang. Show yours. <laughs> That's what I said, it's heck of big. Like a beef patty. <laughs> he got chocolate chips. Okay, let's try it now. Let's cheers. Cheers. Wait, we gotta take a picture. That's fine. Okay, cheers. Whoa. Crazy, the simplest thing. You know, place. Mm. They're, just, they're just bigger and they just have a lot more on. Um, and they're just fresh. It's doughy. Mm. Mm. It's super doughy. Mm -hmm. like a top of a pot pie. That's why the only reason why I don't like sugar cookies because they're like a heart. I love the. Um, this is snickerdoodle. This ain't sugar cookie. Mm, it's like the same thing. What's the difference? Wait to go. I need some, I need some milk. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna drown some water. Good, nice, nice way to, nice way to end our night with some sweets. It's white outside. The night is cold Everyone's lighting